It's estimated that about 2% of the world's population is atheist. For many years, Jennifer Fulweiler was part of that group. She grew up in a happy atheist home. Religion, she thought, was based on a fairy tale, and Christianity was downright dangerous. Yes, I saw Christianity as dangerous, and so I, I really wanted to encourage people to let go of this dangerous belief system. In her book, Something Other Than God, she shares her journey, everything from indifference to intrigue and eventually joy. She says everything changed when she and her husband had their first child. She started asking more questions that atheism could no longer answer. Atheism said that but human life is nothing more than randomly evolved sets of chemical reactions. And that really didn't resonate with my experience as just being alive and, and encountering other people. After reading all kinds of religious books, she says to much of her surprise, she found truth in Christianity. Eventually, she and her husband became Catholic. And looking back, she says her life is now completely different. Well, when I was an atheist, I thought the meaning of life was to have as much money as you could so, so that, I wasn't just greedy, but so that you can do what you want to make yourself happy. That I noticed there was always one more thing I thought I needed to complete my happiness. You know, if I, if I just get this promotion, if I get the new car, if I live in the right place, I was always seeking one more thing. Since then, her faith has grown, and so has her family. She still keeps in touch with some of her atheist friends. They may disagree on what the truth is, but she says they respect the fact that she found faith through reason. And I think sometimes Catholics are a little bit afraid to have friendly dialogues with them because they might think, I don't want to look into these atheistic arguments too much because it might shake my faith. I might not like what I find. And so I always encourage people, in, in the words of John Paul the Great, be not afraid. Ask every tough question, explore every possible avenue you can, and it will only make you more confident in your Catholic faith. It's been a long process to get to where she is now, but she says it was all well worth it.